Technically, I'm I'm a drug dealer. Good morning. Happy cloudy Tuesday. I'm going to work. I haven't been to work in so long. When uh, yeah, the last time Friday. Yeah, Friday. I haven't been to the office since No. Last Wednesday. <laughs> And I don't want to go back into the office. I'd rather go back to a, work a show and sell drugs to doctors. That's what I do. Technically, I'm I'm a drug dealer, but like a legal drug dealer. I'm not breaking bad. And the lights red. What else is new? Bentley is doing okay. He doesn't seem to be in any pain. He's just annoyed by that stupid cone. And I would just keep him in a onesie all the time, but I think I said this yesterday. He peed on it, so <laughs> he can. I let him wear it like in bed when we're in, when he's sleeping, or just when I know he's not gonna pee or poop. I wish like I could figure out how to cut a hole in it because he's so much more comfortable in that. But he does lick his stitches. I actually can't tell if he's licking the incision or if he's just like being a dog and licking his, you know, his manhood. But I don't want to take any chances. But his incision's literally like a half an inch. It's small. I think there's one stitch and it's an internal dissolvable stitch. So just a couple more days. The funny part is he can't fit under the couch and I kind of like that because he likes to run when he knows I'm going to work and hide under the couch and he tried and he was like, Poof. But I feel bad because he's so miserable with the cone on. Even though it's a nice one and it's inflatable, I'm like, you don't even know the other punishments I can put you through. But it's going to be a good day. We're going to be positive and in a good mood. And we're going to keep the momentum going from New Orleans and keep doing business and making those coins clink. And that's my words of inspiration for this morning. I'm also running 15 minutes behind, but it takes me 14 minutes to get to work, so I might come up a minute ahead. They don't let me down. This is like my jam. I'm not really into country, but whenever Fancy by Reba McIntyre comes on, I just turn up. He's like, feed me, you biatch. I'm hungry. I have a cone on. It looks stupid in my... You took my balls off. So this is how we feed him now because he cannot handle the responsibility of eating from a bowl because he eats too fast. And I think I said before, it could lead to bloat, he throws up. So this is how we feed him. He's still transitioning from rice to kibble, so I made his rice. And then we add the kibbles. One third of a cup. Yummies, and then we put it on a plate and we spread it out. Come get this good, good. Mmm, arroz con kibbles is muy bueno. Sit, lay down. Uh uh, lay down. Good boy. He still eats hella fast. But Can I pet you? Good boy. See, you're not aggressive at your plate anymore. Can you slow down, honey? And he's done. There's no more bubbas. There's no more food in the plates. Oh, there's arroz. Mira, look. Get it. Good boy, mi amor. Yummy, 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 yummy. There's no more. There's no more. You can't jump up. You're still healing. Let's take your stupid cone off so you can play. Dude. Okay, you go do you. Okay, keep the keep your stupid cone on. You look so dumb right now. Standing outside my house. Linda, listen to me. There's no food left. Freedom pup. There's no more food left, the bubbles. You ate all the foods. You play fetch, but you're not supposed to run. You have to stay quiet. I am being late night OCD. Do you like my zit? It's compliment to New Orleans. Whenever I wash my face, 
with water from that home. I'm so tired. Whenever I wash my face in a different place, state, whatever, I always break out. My skin looks so rough. I want it to look smooth like a baby boy. But oh well, I guess I'll have to bring bottled water and use that to wash my face because I'm a fancy bish. What's the Bentley's doing? I'm wearing a cone and a onesie. What's going on? Too many things are happening. That's because I couldn't watch him for a while so, and I thought he had to use the bathroom. So I pulled his onesie up. I'm gonna pull it back down when we go to bed. And then we could take the collar off. Cause I caught him. Like I don't know if he's licking like his pain or his stitch, but whatever he's licking, I can't risk it. Cause he can open it and bleed everywhere. Did you see that but you could juggle? I'm boring guys tonight. I have my snack. Out for work tomorrow, not for the whole day, just for, you know, a couple days. I have his measuring spoon waiting here by his food. Wait, I'm gonna speed him with, cause he lost privileges to his bowl. I have my Keurig, and I pick my K cup, and my cup. I have my one Splenda, and my creamer thing. Got the blender ready to make my shake in the morning. I even put the fork in the cup. I don't wanna have to reach for a thing in the morning. I just wanna go. Oh, I have to do lunch. And, ooh, do I get a mosquito bite? Oh no, never mind. Randisha and I went to the Flying Biscuit. Yes, I was excited. So that will be my lunch for tomorrow. And I take a drink from the bottom, I put it at the top, so that way I won't forget. Maybe I should eat this salad. It might be a little rank because, what is on Sunday? Full by 623. I don't know if this is gonna work out. I'm gonna give it the sniff test. I gave Bentley a little piece of carrot, and he hate. You ate it? You like the little, oh. Do you like the little piece of carrot? Oh, excuse me, don't take it to your bed like a trophy. Bye, eat your stupid carrot piece. For my salad that I bought with my money. You got carrot money? Okay, hunty. I think he thinks it's a toy. So, we'll save the flying biscuits left over for tomorrow's dinner. I'm so smart. I want more egg, cause I never get full of salad. So I want some more eggs. Sell by July 30th, we good? I'm done making my unhealthy salad. I put croutons and then some of those onion things cause I love them. There's like some lettuce in the bottom, lots of egg for protein. Well, like egg whites, but I guess I missed that one. Carrots tomatoes and some cheese and some fat free light honey mustard dressing. I used to work with this foreign exchange student in college. We worked at like this grill place called Oscars. I don't know who cares. Y'all don't care what I did in college. And she, I forget where she was from, but she always say, would you like horny mustard? So now like we all call it horny mustard. On that note, I'm gonna call it a night because I'm loopy, tired, and sleepy. And I think Bentley Bear is sleeping. Say bye to all you go. Bye guys, I look so stupid. Miss my balls. Bye!